everybody, Captain here today with Lloyd, the fantastic fantailed pigeon, and today we're going to be giving a review on the Stokes 3-in-1 platform feeder. So there you go. You excited as I am about this one? Yes? Oh yes you are. Alright, so as you can see here the dimensions for the Stokes 31 platform feeder is 18 inches on the long end, 12 inches on the short end there. And there's three ways that you can use to feed this feeder here, or assemble it I might say. So I'm sorry buddy you're gonna have to, sorry Lord you're gonna have to get off of there. Right there you go. I know buddy, we'll get to you in a second, just a second, hold on. So as you see here, we've got a little divot there in the middle. What that's for is for the first option of how you could use to feed this, and that is this right here. This is about a foot long pole, or spoke I might say. And what, what you use for this is, you let's say the ground is here, and you put it about halfway in, about six inches in, so it's about six inches above. And what that does, what that does, is you can connect it to the feeder very easily, and it's just a few inches above the ground for your larger, larger birds like Lloyd over here, or your ducks, your pheasants, your turkeys, that's the uh, ground feeding option for your larger birds. The second option is the only one that is not actually packaged with the product and that is you can mount it on any of your choice of one inch utility poles of any height you want. So if you want it high enough so you can see it from a window or you just want it high enough so a squirrel or a raccoon can't get to it so you can put a baffle on it, that's what that's for. You could use any one inch pole to mount this. And the third and final mounting option is this little hook that comes with it. And it's the top hook they use to hook onto a tree, shrub, or a shepherd hook, anything of your choice for hanging it. And it's got the four little things on the bottom. And what that does is it hooks into the little holes on the side and there's four of them, one in each corner, and there's four little hooks there. So as simple as that. Except for the hanging option, you want to look out for your squirrels and raccoons. They could very easily, you know, break the branch, have it come tumbling down to the ground, and all of your feed be gone to waste. So that I advise you on that one. And that could be avoided with a baffle that you could get at your hardware store, or any Wild Bird Unlimited store in your area. And so let's look at the features of the actual feeder. As you see here, there's a black wire cage over the top of everything. And what that does is it lets the birds easily sit on top of it, or stand on top of it, and it lets them get to the food underneath without having them kick it all around and making a big mess. Wood should know, because he likes to make messes in his cage all the time. He likes to kick all the seeds out. And what this does, it keeps other birds, including you, Wood, keeps other birds from making a big mess under your feeder. And so, helps really you know, cut down on the mess. You know, bird feeders will know all the seed shells underneath it. Could get messy under while over time. And so this helps stop that. And another feature of the feeder are all of these little holes in the bottom. And what that is, is it lets down your rainwater and whatnot lets it drain through the bottom and it helps stop your seed from spoiling from getting wet. 
and what happens if it gets wet it'll get moldy and it's not safe for our feathered friends to eat and as I mentioned it's very heavy duty made out of stainless steel and it's painted brown so very can match just about anything in your yard or apartment if you can feed birds in your apartment it matches just about everything it can be used by just about everyone and in, in conclusion I say that this feeder is a very high quality feeder it's not going to break like your average plastic or glass feeder they could get at the you know ace hardware for really cheap Yeah, those little cheap ears, they make you angry, Lloyd, don't they? Yeah. So, yeah, like I was saying, very high quality feeder can be used by just about everyone. Very easy to use. Three ways to mount it. And it's very versatile. You can take it down, clean it, do whatever you want. Very easy to wash because it doesn't collect water can be easily dried off by any paper towel and you know very it's what I'm looking for in a bird feeder especially a platform feeder so that's it for now me and Lloyd are gonna have to say goodbye until our next video so we'll see you later